don't always see the night. They say they want a real one. They say they want a real one to make them feel young. So before I get this video started, right now in Jersey, there's hella floods going on. So whenever I stop talking, y'all gonna hear this. It's fucking pouring, bro. Like my door is right there. So y'all gonna hear the porridge literally right outside. That's not my, that's not my fault, bro. Y'all just gonna have to deal with it for this specific video. But what's good, family? Welcome back to Astro Nori for another video. Today, we're actually gonna be covering a fire week for Supreme, bro. This is what we've all been waiting for. There's no TNF collab, which I honestly thought that was gonna be it for this week. But hey, I don't know when that shit is gonna drop. If y'all do end up enjoying this video, go ahead and slap that like button for me. It definitely means a lot. I know I said in the previous video, if y'all hit 150 likes, I was gonna do a giveaway. And I'm gonna be giving away five to seven stickers plus a shower cap. That's just something slight. I'm gonna do a bigger giveaway real soon stay tuned for that but go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you are new it definitely goes a long way click the post notification bells if you want to be notified every time i post a video plus y'all get shouted out right here and right here because i've been tripping with the shout out so go ahead shout y'all out right here flourish flourish my people shout out to y'all thank y'all for always showing love but without any further ado man let's get straight into this video all right so we're gonna start with the bullshit per usual all the way at the bottom of the list we got this castellini cycling hat bro if you pull up to the scene with the ceiling missing with this shit on you tripping like why is your brim doing this at the front no bro we don't know no 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 we don't need this shit if the brim was an actual brim this right here is the mars black men essential if y'all know who that is y'all already know what i'm talking about the shit that say brooklyn at the bottom and it's bent the fuck up like that we gonna skip that shit because this is straight duke -a loop we gonna leave it right at the bottom where it deserves to be next up we got these rhinestone basketball shorts i'm not gonna lie these shits are kind of a vibe you could wear these shits on an everyday basis in the summertime because these shits are breathable for the new sack if y'all know what i'm talking about the black colorway is probably the one that i would definitely go for because honestly bro y'all don't typically see me wear all these colors like i'm normally wearing straight blizzak or something similar or something around the corner from it you feel me but right here we do got these rhinestone shorts i like the fact that the branding is right down the side these low-key look like some essential basketball shorts and they don't look that bad design wise it doesn't look like they did the most but it doesn't look like they did the least if that makes any sense i just really hope these shits got pockets because when it comes to basketball shorts you don't get the privilege of pockets like i don't know that's just what it is really i think these do have pockets though which would be a plus in my opinion not bad i don't know if these will have any resale i just feel like they look good for the personal just for lounging or chilling around type shit or if it's hot as hell hey going out fuck it next up we got the matching jersey to these shorts right here jersey not so much personally i just don't fuck with jerseys that much but these jerseys these are okay i'm not gonna lie to y'all we got like the pistons colorway or the clippers whatever y'all want to say we got the bulls little colorway we got the knicks we got that camel color which is kind of like the mighty ducks hey i'm just saying then we got the black which is the one that i would go for if i were to cop one of these shits it doesn't look bad though in my opinion it does got the 94 at the bottom which is a pretty clean touch but for me it's just a dub when it comes to this i would personally go for the shorts before i go for the tank top or the basketball jersey you feel me now next up these water shorts are straight crap these shits are so clean to me specifically in that menta green colorway so fire bro the pastel yellowish color so clean honestly all these shits are hard i'm not even gonna lie to you i would go for that menta green colorway i would go for the yellow one the navy is hard the black is hard the red is hard low key i need to cop this for summer but i don't know i don't know what i'm gonna go for as of yet honestly that water gun is calling my name i just want to know the price on it because if it is anywhere near a hundred dollars they can fuck off like i don't need it that much you feel me like it's a fire accessory but i'm not paying anywhere near a hundred dollars when you can go buy one for like 15 to 20 that shit just don't make no sense like no sense that shit's fucking radical bro but these water shorts right here these shits right here these are a must bro that mint i'm trying to tell y'all that mint green color fire bro that mint one is gonna be the first one to sell out i need these shits i would honestly wear these shits as regular shorts that's how hard these are to me but i don't know what colorway i would go for hopefully they're around that one 118 price point because i might just have to scoop scoop those but next up we got the s logo polo i'm gonna let y'all know this right here if you know one thing about me is i haven't worn a polo probably in like five to seven years i'm not gonna lie to you maybe even more i don't fuck with polos that's just not my thing like 
I could wear a button up maybe here and there sporadically, but a polo, nah, they could hold that shit. But this shit right here is something that I'm actually considering, bro. I don't wear this at all, like I'm telling you. But this polo right here is calling my name. I don't know, it's just clean. I like the S logo on the side. It's not doing too much. It's keeping it real simple, low key, if you know, you know type vibes. Sometimes those are the best vibes. Not everybody need to know the Supreme on the front type shit, specifically with this piece right here, cause this is that get bougie, go out type shit, you feel me? But you still flexing on them. I don't know. Fire piece though, nonetheless, honestly, I'm getting something this week. Either the S logo shorts, which I'm gonna cover in a little bit, the S logo polo or the water shorts. One of those three things I gotta get. Like it's just mandatory at this point. But we got this Castellini cycling jersey. This is the one that we saw for the preview. Like the little preview picture that we saw at the beginning of the season was this right here. So it's kind of crazy that they dropping this shit all the way at the end of the season. But I know people gonna go crazy over this shit right here simply because they got the big ass logo on the front, that fake Supreme from, I don't even know, Spain or wherever the fuck they got the fake Supreme store. That logo on the front of this shit. But people gonna love it. It got logos on the side, both sides. It got Supreme blasted on the sides. Got the Gucci colorway at that. People are literally gonna faint over this shit. I don't f with it. I'm not even gonna lie. This shit got too much fucking logos. Like it don't even make sense to me. And I fuck with the logo sometimes. This is just a little bit too much. To me, this is a cycling jersey and it's just that. Like it's just a cycling jersey. That's the way I view it. You feel me? You might fuck with this shit. And at the end of the day, cop what you want. Like I like going for what I like going for. And I hope y'all do the same. You feel me? But this right here for me is just a dub. I feel like it's too much going on. I do like the fact that it does have the BOGO on the front. That's pretty cool, I guess. But then you got BOGO here, BOGO here, big ass branding on both sides. I don't, it's just, it's loaded like it's too much shit going on i'm good on that one right there but i feel like that one probably will do good resale wise because people fuck with the logos bro let's be real but we about to get into the two most hype pieces that we have confirmed for this week so far first we got these s logo shorts these shits are a vibe like i'll take any color give me any color i don't care i'll take them all fuck it the yellow one super crispy for the summertime the red one is the one that honestly i'm leaning towards but that navy or the black are the essential shorts because you could wear them shits with everything and i really mess with the s logo i feel like i've brought that up previously the s logo is probably one of my favorite logos simply because it's just simple bro it just has the s logo and if you know you know low key that was probably one of the first pieces that i saw from supreme it was like one of the s logo hats and i saw some other shit too but that's really what caught my attention it was more so on some shit like yo what is that like i don't know what the hell that is because it's only an s logo so i don't know who it's from until i got into to Stussy then I was like yo ah that's what that was then I got into Supreme and now I'm here that's another story for another day the S logo shorts go crazy I feel like retail for these should be around at 118 128 which is honestly not too bad when it comes to these right here I feel like the quality shouldn't be too bad I feel like these are gonna be so clean in the summertime I would probably end up going for the black or navy if I don't get those the red or the yellow is fine with me and if I don't get those the water shorts is fine with me too I would go for either of the shorts that's honestly what I'm going for this week I'm gonna leave the polo to the side as much as I do like it I feel like the shorts is the way to go specifically with summer coming up I usually buy hella tees and I end up with no bottom so I'm gonna go ahead and buy the shorts smart decision rational thinking let's get it boy that's what we're going for this week both shorts that's all I need either or or both it is what it is you feel me but the shorts are fire and last up we do got the water gun now as far as the water gun goes I'm feeling it I know I let y'all know that previously but I feel like the retail on this could be either too too high or yeah too high like that's it like if it's too high it's a fuck it because i need the shorts like i could wear the shorts the water gun i'm gonna pum pum two times and be like yo let me put this shit up so it doesn't fuck up that's literally what would end up happening i'm not trying to do all that like if it was 38 48 dollars 50 maybe yeah i'm cool with that but a hundred dollars for that shit they could hold the tip i'm good on all sides like i'm not trying to spend a hundred to just spray that shit twice and be like yo hold up this is a display item fuck that nah i'm good i'm trying to get some shorts because i'm gonna actually end up wearing those a lot like i already know myself know myself yeah that's pretty much it for everything that we had this week so far this is not the full drop list when the full drop list does come out for tomorrow i will cover that but if y'all enjoyed this video man leave a like i'm gonna actually cover a little bit of resale fuck it so resale wise i feel like if the water gun is not too expensive and it's around that under 60 price point it could possibly do good specifically with summer coming around the corner 
corner. You already know hype beasts are gonna want to flex with the water gun in the pool or whatever the fuck. That's what people do. But we also do got the S logo set. I feel like the shorts will probably end up doing better than the polo simply because, like I said, it is summertime. So people are gonna be more prone to lean towards the shorts, just like the water shorts. I feel like the water shorts might not do too good. I don't know why. I feel like they probably would. They probably won't. That's like an iffy one for me. But honestly, I wouldn't care if them shit sit for a day. Like, I just need them shit because I feel like they're so clean. And last spring, summer, I was trying to go for some shorts that were actually hard. Shit, pa poof. Like, I couldn't even try to get them shits. They were just gone. And that was kind of dookie. So, I'm going to definitely try to go for some shorts this year and see if we succeed. But, hey, that pretty much does it for this video. If y'all did enjoy this one, man, leave a like on it down below. It definitely goes a long way. And I do appreciate it from the top and bottom of my heart. Shout out to Jacob Star because that's the GOAT low key. But, yo, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Click the post notification bells. It definitely does mean a lot. And I will be shouting y'all out in the next video, which will be tomorrow. I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Peace. Stay up and I'm out. Never see the sun, always see the night. They say they want a real one, they say they want a real one to make them feel young.